Okay, guys, check out Michigan Constitutional Crusaders channel. I'll put the link to it in the description. He does very good work on dealing with law enforcement. Understanding that the police are not your friends and they cannot be trusted. Look at it like this, man. The police are not your friends. They don't care about you. They don't respect you. At the end of the day, it is your right to film law enforcement. Now, people are getting upset because I keep repeating it. They always film the police. It's true. You have to always film the police when you're being confronted by them. I'm not giving you bad information, right? People say, well, we know that. You don't know that. Because if you did know that, you would do it. I see people all the time. When I'm walking down the street, they get pulled over or they're being stopped by law enforcement. And I got to pull out my phone because they're not filming it. So I have to film it for them. So I see it all the time. It's always good to have it embedded into your brain that anytime you deal with the police, you should always film the police. It's that simple. If you want to cooperate with law enforcement, give your ID, let them search you, all that stuff. Even though I don't, I don't agree with agree with it, do you. But at least document the interaction because if something happens to you and it's not on camera, then it's your butt. And you know as well as I do, if it goes to court, who going to win? You are the law enforcement. So who going to win? Who's getting paid tax dollars by the state? You are the police officer. Not you. Unless you work for a government job or something. I don't know. But, you know, understand that the cops are not your friends. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Check out the community tab at 3 p.m. Central Time. And remember, always film the police. I'm out, guys. Peace out. I'll be adding additional commentary and narration. Check this out. Two of them coming out. Isn't that hilarious? That's cop two of them coming out. No. No. What? What? Isn't that hilarious? That's comical. That is cool. Right? Great. Who are you? Who are you? Who am I? Yeah. Manager. Oh, okay, cool. What's going on? I don't know. You have, you have customers. You should probably go manage that. I do have customers. Okay, have a nice night. Okay. Right to the phone. Yep. Right next to a checkers. Right. Smoke your weed and get your, your grub on at the well, same time. Like perfect setup, man. Best business model ever. Right. Put your dispensary next to a restaurant. So he called the popo, and now the lady, the manager, called the popo. Yeah. So here's the thing. When you go to jail, right, for something you didn't do, especially when you know for a fact the cop is lying through his teeth, not only to you, but in court, right? It's a horrible experience and it literally ruins your life because the longer you sit in jail, the, the higher chance you have of losing everything, your job, your house, your car, all of the stuff that you've earned accumulated through your lifetime is gone because you're either paying legal fees and you're not able to pay your rent or mortgage because you're sitting in jail because you're unable to work because you're sitting in jail. And I think that's the most, I think that's like the majority of why the police are being like, they, they're not as like, they're not as light as they, as they should be because of those reasons. They, they falsely arrest people and they don't care about the life they ruin. That's why the cops live in the way they do. Really? Another one? What are you doing, honey? You, are you videotaping? Yep. You don't have my permission to well, be on camera. I don't need it. Yes, you do. By no, law. I don't. By law, you need it. No, I don't. You're incorrect, ma'am. Why? Tell me why I'm incorrect. Where, where am I standing, ma'am? Uh, on the sidewalk. Public sidewalk, right? Yes, but you're taking 
And anything I can see in public, I can record. So even if it's a private business, if I can see it from public, I can record it. That's how it works, man. No. Really? You're you gonna waste three? Oh, there's the police right there. Yeah, you can talk to them all you want. They're gonna tell you the same thing. We're not doing anything illegal. So have a nice night, ma'am. You'll be educated by them. Have a nice night. So here's the thing, guys. The cops arrived, but they don't get exactly what they want because they do the silent treatment, which is which is funny. They're having a conversation amongst each other, and the police don't want to interrupt them, but they're not stopping the conversation with the police. Get back to the video. Hi. Oh, let me pose for the portrait. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here, I'll do what the police like to do. There you go. <laughs> what are you gonna do with that? Stick it on Facebook? No. I think you record it to you. <laughs> that was good. As long as you don't put it on a, on your wall for, you know, mischievous purposes. <laughs> and she's over there getting edumacated. Yeah. What's that? Oh, he's got a porn stash? He's got a porn stash. Oh, he sure does. He's got the porn stash. He's got that Magnum P.I. stash going down. Always film the police because it is your First Amendment right to do so. Get back to the video and enjoy. There we go. She's walking away educated. Absolutely not a word. You know, I was really craving one of those mushroom Swiss burgers, too. That's does sound pretty good. I know. We'll have to go to another location yeah, and get one. There we go. There's one in Battle Creek. Yeah, I want to go to Battle Creek. Because yeah. I like those mushroom Swiss. And then the, the spicy chicken they have is pretty good, too. Yeah, that yeah. mushroom Swiss does sound great. Yeah. Yeah. Or we could go to Taco Bell. I do like the Crunch Wrap Supreme. I, I like the uh, cheesy bean and rice burrito. <laughs> I like the burrito supreme. It's 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 good. They're charging five bucks for that oh, damn really? thing now. Yeah, really? sir, must be the extra sour sir, cream. It's crazy. crazy. Have a, a yeah, they must be putting extra sour cream in it. Right. Yeah. I always add extra sour cream, so that puts it over five dollars. Yeah, really, it does. Mm-hmm. Just for one simple burrito that I can make at home for like fifty cents. Right. Right. It's crazy. It is crazy. Totally mm -hmm. insane. It is. Well, at, least, at least the sound of the traffic is drowning out that music over there. It is, yeah. That yeah. yeah, is nice. That way we don't have to mute our, our volume. Right. You know? I was worried about that at first, but it didn't travel this far. No, I was didn't. worried that the music was going to travel over here, but it didn't. <laughs> She's so butter. She's so butter. <laughs> they won't talk to me. <laughs> Look at him smiling over there with the porn stand. Yeah. <laughs> he thinks it's amusing. <laughs> <laughs> he just left her here for two minutes for herself. Yeah, he? he sure did. So the fact of the matter is, they didn't. The cops wanted to interject their conversation, interrupt their conversation, but they held their ground. And now she got upset because they wouldn't talk to her. The Fifth Amendment gives you the right to remain silent. You also do not have to answer any cop, any police officer's questions when questioned. The fact is, the cops, they don't care. Remember, when you go to that jail, it ruins your life. Because the fact is this, even if you get found innocent, you just wasted months in jail, you lost everything. 
I mean, that's that's like the cops. If the cops would just do the right thing, if they know the person is not committing a crime, let them be. Right? That's all they gotta do. Let them be. But no, 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 no. They gotta get your ID. They gotta write you for warrants. And if you don't have warrants, they still gotta disrespect you in some sort of way because that's what they do. It's an us versus them mentality they have, and it's unfortunate that these cops don't care. So you have to know your rights while dealing with the cops. The police are just not your friends. And people are just like, well, for what you just gotta do, you just gotta follow the law, bro. You can go to, I, you know how many times I've been arrested and I haven't done nothing illegal? You know how many times I went to jail and sat months for something I didn't do? I mean, you ever, you ever been charged with a felony for a crime you didn't commit? I have. And it's disgusting. This is why police are are not respected anymore, man. It's, it's, it's the truth. I'm not lying about it. Get back to the video, guys. And enjoy. Oh, he wants to come out and do a cam back. <laughs> they told him, don't do it. Oh, that guy's upset. That guy seems a little bit perturbed. Is he making threats back there? Probably, the way they were clapping. It's not like he was making threats. And and doesn't look like they're gonna do anything about well, of it. Of course not. They never do their jobs. And there's the guy that thinks he can sue us. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> um, I'm thinking catwalk time, isn't it? Watch her come running over. Who the hell do you think you are? Get away from my car. No, I don't need to. Get away from my car. I don't need to. Get away from my car. I don't need to. That's our car. I'm not getting in my car with him this close to it. Hmm, I guess you should have been polite instead of being rotten ass yeah, to me. Own the car. Had you a politely you. asked me to move, maybe I would have moved. I've been but telling to me to get away from the car, it What's don't work that way. Like I've seen a lot of videos lately where people are defending the police actions. They're just doing their jobs. They're just doing it the way they're supposed to be doing it, the way they're trained. Look. If you falsely accuse someone of something and throw them in jail and they lose everything because of that, and you knowingly... Now, that's one thing to be like, oh, we throw you in jail. It's a mistake, right? And they quickly fix it. But if you throw somebody in jail, knowingly it's false. After you find out and you allow them to sit in jail for extended periods of time and they lose everything, I think that officer should lose a job. Remember, every life is sacred. And the fact of the matter is, when a police officer locks you up for something you didn't do, and you lose everything, I don't care. She should lose a job. And she should have to pay the legal fees and whatever the guy lost. And that's how it should be. Get back to the video and enjoy. Get away from you need to get car. back, it's sir, because at this point it is an officer safety concern for me. No, I am not opening. And what law is that? I am not opening my door. What law is officer safety? Here. Yeah, what law is officer? So climb in through the passenger seat then. What law? Smart ass. You are being ridiculous, sir. No, you are being ridiculous. Coming out here telling me orders when I don't have to follow your orders. I didn't break no law. No, I don't. That's at where you're point, wrong, honey. At this point, I am asking you to step away order? from my car. Is that a lawful order? To step away from you could you politely yes. ask. Is that a lawful order? Yes, it is. Do you, you have the lawful authority to make that order? At this point, I don't know what you are doing. Okay. I do not trust your Pretty actions. Pretty obvious. I do not trust your obvious. actions. Well, that's your problem. I, I don't trust your actions. It's quite you obvious what people. we're doing. I have never shot you anybody. Guys shoot people. I've never shot anybody. Okay, well, cops shoot people. What's You're your badge cop? number? Another one four five nine two. Thank you. And, and other yours, sir? Shoot people as well. One, yeah, four, nine, sure do. Three, four, and the name? Cops that shoot people and get away with it. Think? Yeah, I can't see that because it's you know too dark. But I can see that one. Yeah, you shouldn't just bark orders at people. Well, in public. At this point, you give me nice. no choice. Like, you no, just we didn't give you no could choice. You step, could you step aside so I could get my vehicle, sir? That would that should, that nice should be how you treat walk. the public, not get away from my vehicle. I was trying but to be nice I don't, on the I sidewalk, and all you guys wanted there. to talk to or talk I didn't about want to was talk to you over there, and I'm not That's required it. to, right? I didn't want to talk to you over there, and I'm not required to. I was trying to be polite. I know you was, but I'm still not required to talk to you. 
I didn't call. Well, them. actually, you them. weren't being polite. You were interrupting our conversation. Yeah, you should have went over there and talked to them first before coming up to, the, to us because they called you, not I us. I wanted to get your side you're, you're, first. I, there is we, no my side. To get out of here and just leave you all alone. There is no my side. I'm on a public sidewalk doing what I'm lawfully allowed to do. That's And that's that. what we told them. Okay, we were cool. actually defending what cool. you were doing. Cool. At this point, though, I cannot defend this. Oh, I don't. I don't need you to defend. No, anything. Was... the Constitution defends what I'm doing. You should worry about whether the Constitution defend what you do. Hmm. And walking out and t being rude and barking orders at civilians. Did either one of us break a law? Constitution's not going to back you up on that. At this point, like I said, officer safety. I just didn't want officer, you to Always film the police. Get back to the video, guys. And enjoy. It's not a law, though. I'm asking, did either one of us break a law? you you shouldn't have became a cop. Have went into the private sector if you're so scared. Not everybody is a threat out here. Did either but one of us break a lock? Everybody I know like that. you're a threat. Neither one of us broke a lock, correct? No. Not correct? Or is correct? I answered the first part of your question. Nobody broke the law. Okay, so since none, neither of us broke the law, then we deserve respect because you work for the people. Okay, However, and it's not ridiculous for an officer to tell someone to get away from their vehicle. Awesome. You could ask, would you please step away from my vehicle? If you had said it like that, I would have said, sure, no problem. But you said it in a rude manner. Respect is everything. We didn't treat you with disrespect just because we were having a conversation and did not want to talk to you. is not disrespectful. It's our Fifth Amendment right. We don't have to talk to you. We never have to talk to you. Okay? So try having a little bit more respect for the people you work for. And then you'll get respect in return. Because we broke no laws. The only time you have authority over a citizen is when they break a law. Learn your place. I can leave. Okay. But you need to understand your place in the food chain. I appreciate what you're saying. I'm not trying to be an asshole here, but you were being rude, so you got it back. That's how that works. Just like respect gets respect. Okay. Okay? Have a great night. Now have a nice night and stay safe. One of my favorite officers. Is he? Yeah. One of your favorites? Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. All right, guys. You be How's safe going? Here, okay? right, you too, I'm glad you had a good time downtown. Oh, man. Well, Absolutely. Every time you come to Calumet, you know, good. It's so wonderful here. How long you been canine? Almost four years. Yeah. Best Same dog you've had the whole time? Or? Yeah, best, best gig on the department. Is it? Right on. Well, just with the dog. Right. right. Get to use him a lot? Um, we do a lot of tracking. A lot yeah. of tracking with yeah. him? That's yeah. awesome. Heck yeah. Let's say, I, I, and you know, <laughs> when I was a kid, they didn't have dogs, so they couldn't no. track him. <laughs> it was a different world then, wasn't Man, it? Wasn't, wasn't it? it? Wasn't it? <laughs> All right, you guys be safe. All right, you can yep, talk. I'll do. Yes, sir. Are you a licensed production company? Nope. They, they don't have to be to be in the public or broadcast. I'm, I'm an independent journalist. Well, my name, well, my face on the Okay. And my permission. Okay, go ahead. Get You'll be on list. YouTube tonight. Yeah, tonight. Later yeah, tonight. You'll be in the thumbnail. Yeah. Yep. Nice have a good one, man. Have a nice night. Check out Michigan's Constitutional Crusaders channel. I'll put the link to his channel in the description as I said before. He does very good work on dealing with law enforcement. It's important that you know your rights. While dealing with law enforcement in the United States, always from the police. All original links in the description. Check out the community tab at 3 p.m. Central Time. I think I'm going to add a Discord so you guys can join it.